guys, today I shall be playing Microsoft Flight. It's off Steam and it's a free download. Um, to begin, I shall do a free flight and just show you the basics. And then we can move on to a, one challenge and see how that works. So, to control the plane, you um, use either the arrow keys or you can use the mouse. Now I'm using the arrow keys because I prefer those better than the mouse and it's e for me easier to control it varies from different people um so to no up uh, to take down your wheels you press G or now I had them down so this is a very good graphics so you can see them going up and you can see them going down you can also change the camera views of the plane so that chase view like that then and cockpit view I prefer the uh, the beginning view because you can see the whole plane and yeah so I'm gonna see if I can land preferably not here because there's a bunch of trees everywhere so, it's, this game is a very good graphic game. You can see all the details, no, don't crash, and you can see the propeller, and it's just really good altogether. Um, again, it's a free download, so you don't have to pay anything, and off Steam, so you just have to download Steam, and then search Microsoft Flight and then you get the game. You probably gonna enjoy this a lot. Um other things. Oh yeah. In cockpit view you press oh you, to pre change you press F seven to change the camera view. Um in the cockpit view or in any other view you can right click and you can move around in the cockpit and like see yourself see oops it's also good graphics because you can if you move around and you then speed up or throttle up uh, this is pretty hard to steer but if you press throttle down you see the see it moving if you go up you see the thing moving and yeah then you can go back out of cockpit view and I'll see if I can land on the water so you need your wheels in I think you can land with on water with wheels down but you can you it's preferred to do it with wheels up it's better to do um yeah so i'll just fly to the ocean maybe do some wing dipping is like will dial is pretty good to do and uh yeah and then we'll move on to the challenges afterwards one challenge so, we again, it's very good graphics. So, it's technically like Google Earth Flight Simulator, but you can change viewpoints. You can look inside the cockpit, and it's much better uh, graphics. And you don't see that green stuff on your screen, which sometimes distracts me. Oh yeah, this takes place in Hawaii, and you as you complete challenges, you can get different colors for your planes, and you move on to different, um, different islands, and yeah, now we're on a, not much of a house island thing, so it's not, I wouldn't say it's that populated, and, um, but you can move on to Maui and there's houses and stuff. But I'm 
still going to land and then do some wing dipping. Oops, failing about this. Torching the water in three, two, one. Yes, and I crashed at failing. So, pretty good graphics, and the cockpit opens up when you crash. And then it says, crashed with an ambulance on it. As you see, there, and cockpit opens, you crashed. So I'm going to exit free flight. And yeah, this game is very good and I would rate it 10 out of 10. You should get it. That was this was Docker 99 and adios.